In this video, we are going to focus on the partial and total pressure of mixtures. There are two formulas which are needed to calculate the two different pressures. The total pressure of a mixture is equal to the sum of all individual partial pressures in the mixture. This formula is called the Dalton's law of partial pressure. The partial pressure of a gas is equal to the moles of that gas, multiplied with the gas constant, multiplied with the temperature, divide by the volume of the container. I will explain the use of these formulas by an exercise. A mixture containing 0.50 moles of hydrogen gas, 1.00 moles of oxygen gas and 3.50 moles of nitrogen gas is confined in a 25.0 liter vessel at 25 degrees. A. Calculate the total pressure of the mixture. B. Calculate the partial pressure of each of the gases in the mixture. We already know that the total pressure is equal to the sum of the individual partial pressures. So at first we need to calculate the partial pressures. We know the moles of hydrogen, oxygen and nitrogen. We also know the temperature, which is 25 degrees, which is equal to 298.15 Kelvin. The volume of the vessel is 25 liter, which is equal to 0.025 cubic meter. The gas constant is 8.314 joule per mole Kelvin, which is equal to 8.314 newton meter per mole Kelvin. If we apply these data in the formula, we receive these three calculuses. This allows us to cancel units of mole Kelvin and meter and leaves us with the unit of Newton per square meter. If we calculate the three partial pressures, we receive the following results. The partial pressure of hydrogen is 0.5 bar. The partial pressure of oxygen is 1 bar and the partial pressure of nitrogen is 3.5 bar. Now we can calculate the total pressure of the mixture. We already know that the total pressure of a mixture is equal to the sum of all individual partial pressures. That means that our total pressure is equal to the sum of the partial pressures of hydrogen, oxygen and nitrogen, which we have calculated before. If we add up the results, we received a total pressure of 5 bar.